India dethroned Indonesia, who were 14 time champions of the Thomas Cup, to become the champions this year. I am joined by one of the history makers from that team at this hour, Kidambi Shrikant, former world number one. Shrikant, thank you very, very much for joining us. Uh, have you managed any sleep since then? <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah, I did get a good night's sleep. <laughs> and, and, and what did you guys do after that? Because H.S. Pranoy, we were talking to him before the final. He said, we will have a party and we'll keep the videos um, to our, ourselves. We are not going to release them to the public. <clears throat> we uh, haven't really partied. We went out for a team uh, dinner. That's it. We haven't really partied much. Shrikant, uh, you know, we've heard about you being a homesick boy and you don't like traveling that much. But being with a team, uh, does that help you uh, to perform even better? Because then you are with others as well and not that much homesick. Uh, I think I kind of used to traveling now because, uh, you know, after after the lockdown, you know, the last six months, it has been very tough, you know. Uh, you know, last year, I think I played about uh, nine or ten tournaments and I was traveling continuously for three months. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> so it was, it was uh, really tough. But, uh, you know, now to travel as a team, to, uh, to be part of a team and then to, you know, have lunch, dinner and breakfast as a team, you know, it's a different experience, you know, which doesn't usually happen in badminton. And uh, yeah, all of us really enjoyed being as a team. And uh, uh, yeah, I know it's it's a it's a different experience. And uh, and uh, the icing on the cake is that we won this tournament. Uh, you won this tournament, and you beat fourteen-time champions Indonesia. When you know you were to take on Indonesia and Malaysia and Denmark, the powerhouse, so-called powerhouses um, in badminton. Um, were there times when you know you had to uh, strategize a lot? Uh, you had to speak to each other about team selection as well. Definitely, we 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 made sure that we talk before and after matches. Uh, you know, just to uh, keep that team spirit going. You know, we we spoke. We 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 had team meetings every day, and then we really told each other that even if you uh, you know in some of the matches say like Laksha lost. Uh, you know, one or two of his matches, and then we we went and told him that you know we are we still believe in you. You can do it. And then uh, Satvik Chirag, they've lost one of their matches against Chinese Taipei. You know, we spoke. We told them that you know we still believe in them, and then they can do it for us in the next matches. And uh, you know, I, I think all these kinds of team meetings really did help because you know if you see when it did really matter, you know, Lakshya pulled off his first single. And then uh, Satik Chirag, uh, you know, won their double. So, uh, you know, it it like everyone just uh, you know played their part, and uh, you know, just very happy that uh, uh, I had the opportunity, that I had the privilege to finish off the tournament with a win.